substance-induced psychosis is a form of substance use disorder where psychosis can be attributed to substance use. It is a psychosis that results from the poisonous effects of chemicals or drugs, including those produced by the body itself. Various psychoactive substances have been implicated in causing or worsening psychosis in users. Effects of Psychosis Psychosis manifests as disorientation and visual hallucinations. It is a state in which a person's mental capacity to recognize reality, communicate, and relate to others is impaired, thus interfering with the capacity to deal with life demands. While there are many types of psychosis, substance-induced psychosis can be pinpointed to specific chemicals. Substances, psychotic states may occur after using a variety of legal and illegal substances. Usually such states are temporary and reversible, with fluoroquinolone-induced psychosis being a notable exception. Drugs whose use, abuse, or withdrawal are implicated in psychosis include the following. Equals ICD-10 equals, F10.5 alcohol. Alcohol is a common cause of psychotic disorders or episodes, which may occur through acute intoxication, chronic alcoholism, withdrawal, exacerbation of existing disorders, or acute idiosyncratic reactions. Research has shown that alcohol abuse causes an eight-fold increased risk of psychotic disorders in men and a three-fold increased risk of psychotic disorders in women. While the vast majority of cases are acute and resolve fairly quickly upon treatment and or abstinence, they can occasionally become chronic and persistent. Alcoholic psychosis is sometimes misdiagnosed as another mental illness such as schizophrenia. F12.5 cannabinoid, some studies indicate that cannabis, especially certain strains containing large proportions of THC and low proportions of CBD, may lower the threshold for psychosis and thus help to trigger full-blown psychosis in some people. Recent studies have found an increase in risk for psychosis in cannabis users. It is not clear whether this is a causal link. It is possible that cannabis use only increases the risk of psychosis in people already predisposed to it. F13.5 Sedatives Hypnotics It is also important to this topic to understand the paradoxical effects of some sedative drugs. Serious complications can occur in conjunction with the use of sedatives creating the opposite effect as to that intended. Malcolm Lader at the Institute of Psychiatry in London estimates the incidence of these adverse reactions at about 5%, even in short-term use of the drugs. The paradoxical reactions may consist of depression, with or without suicidal tendencies, phobias, aggressiveness, violent behavior and symptoms sometimes misdiagnosed as psychosis. However, psychosis is more commonly related to the benzodiazepine withdrawal syndrome. F14.5 cocaine, F15.5 other stimulants, amphetamines. Methamphetamine. Methylphenidate. See also stimulant psychosis. F16.5 hallucinogens, the code F11.5 is reserved for opioid-induced psychosis and F17.5 is reserved for tobacco-induced psychosis, but neither substance is traditionally associated with the induction of psychosis. The code F15.5 also includes caffeine-induced psychosis, despite not being specifically listed in the dsm -IV. However, there is evidence that caffeine, in extreme acute doses or when severely abused for long periods of time, may induce psychosis. Equals other equals Fluoroquinolone drugs. Fluoroquinolone use has been linked to serious cases of toxic psychosis that have been reported to be irreversible and permanent. See adverse effects of fluoroquinolones. The related quinoline derivative mefloquine has also been associated with psychosis. Some over the counter drugs, including dextromethorphan at high doses, certain antihistamines at high doses, cold medications, prescription drugs prednisone and other corticosteroids, isotretinoin, anticholinergic drugs, atropin, scopolamine, antidepressants, L-dopa, antiepileptics, antipsychotics, in an idiosyncratic reaction, other illegal drugs, including, MDMA, fencyclidin, ketamine, synthetic research chemicals used recreationally, including, JWH018 and some other synthetic cannabinoids, 
or mixtures containing them. Various JWHXXX compounds in spice, or in scents have also been found and have been found to cause psychosis in some people. Mephedrone and related amphetamine-like drugs sold as bath salts, or plant food. Plants, Hawaiian baby woodrose, morning glory seeds, jimson weed, belladonna, salvia divinorum. Volatile solvents and gases, toluene, found in glue, paint, thinner, etc. See also toluene toxicity. Butane, gasoline. References <laughs>